Hi there everybody, it's Housie from slimandstylish.com and I'm a UK independent demonstrator and today I'm here with all my gorgeous swaps from on stage. This box here is all my on stage swaps and just under my desk I have a bag full of team retreat swaps as well for you so I'm going to run through them as quick as possible while still showing you the um, details of who's made them so you can go and check them out wherever they've been made. So first up I've got this big box, and it is a big box, three inches by six inches, the library clip. Can you see? It's got a little divider in. And it's got a jar of jam, a gift from Essex. It doesn't say who who's it from, though. And some crackers. So, there we go. And the box has all been stamped with the incredible like these stamp set that's quite cute I've got some bookmarks doo, 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 doo. I haven't really sorted these out it, my box is quite jumbled so whenever I grab something I'll try and grab others that are like it but I might miss them um, stamping with Stephanie just crafting around little pink daisy and this one is by Jacqueline Calder um, and she's from our team, but she couldn't make the retreat on Sunday, so I swapped with her on Saturday instead. I tried not to swap with our team on Saturday because I knew I'd be seeing them all on Sunday and could swap them. So this is by Marianne Everett, and it's wildflower seeds, and they've escaped. <laughs> so it's like a matchbook box. I'm not going to open it because the seeds are pretty much, you know, everywhere. I would get into a mess. Oh, now this was cute. I loved this. This is a little tiny box with the Tic Tacs in by Rachel Berry from Berry Beautiful Paper Crafts. And it's got Made With Love and the Stampin' Up! logo. But look how miniature that box is. I mean, that is, that's an inch by an inch and a half with a little Tic Tacs in. How cute. Oh, I loved this one. Carol Willis from Snug Cottage Crafts. She came over and she didn't have many swaps left and I literally fought people to get this swap because I loved it. Look at the shaker card. I love shaker cards and it's all glittery. I was so happy to get this. So uh, thank you, Carol. Uh, do -do -do -do, this is Kim Price. Oh, she's stuck her label over the bottom. Come on. Oh, that was a good label, it didn't rip. <laughs> so it's an envelope with, oh, Stroop Waffle. I love those. One of the girls in our team, she brings these over when we have team meetups and they're lovely. Love that, that's a, that's a great swap. Great swap, very happy. Some card fronts. I think there's a few card friends. So I'll run through them all. A woofer. <laughs> so we've got this one. This is Helen Chapman. And she's used the um, wood grain embossing folder on that. I'm not sure if you can see it um, because it's a dark colour, but she has it. It's all um, embossed in the background. The doilies. And that's by Maureen Roots. And I like how they're all different colours. That's that's quite cute. Butterflies. Butterflies are definitely, definitely the thing at the moment, aren't they? Ling Clifford. I'm going to come back to the dog because I love that. Uh, Caroline Brownlee. Adhesive back sequins. Love adhesive back sequins. Butterflies again. And that's um, Rebecca Deary. And this one here, this is gorgeous. Isn't that lovely? Keep calm on my gone, but it's so glittery. There is glitter all over that. It's really shimmery. And it's um, Catherine Hawkridge. It's card front. Love it. I've got a hanger here with the butterflies on. These are watercolour wash by the look of it. Um, yes, it's watercolour paper. Beautiful. And it's by um, Kylie Henshaw. 
few three a few three D swaps now. So we've got post-it notes. If you've ever watched my videos, you know how much I love post-it notes. They mask everything. I love them. Liz Rockingham. It's quite apt as well because I did a presentation on stage and I used post-it notes um, on it. So if I'd have ran out Liz Rockingham, you'd have come to my rescue. <laughs> um, a triangle cheat box. Let's have a note. This is all hand stamped as well. This is the Oso oh Eclectic set. Oh, and it's got the... They're quite cute, the fizzy, fizzy candies. And it's made by... Um, Esther Howard. Thank you, Esther. A half cracker. They must have a proper name, but I always call them half cracker because it looks like half a cracker. Um, a little treat for someone sweet. Oh no, they've knotted the ribbon. Have I got some snips? Just gonna have to run to my craft tote. I took my snips away with me and I haven't unpacked that bag yet. I've got hundreds of bags, that's why I'm doing my video with my swaps because I don't like to unpack. I love packing, because I'm going somewhere, but unpacking, I don't like unpacking. Oozy eggs. Oh, that sounds interesting, doesn't it? Oh, I don't know who it's from. It hasn't got anything in it. But thank you for my oozy eggs. Oh, that's cute. With the little deer. It just pops up like that. And inside we have two little Easter eggs. And it's... That also hasn't got anything in, but thank you for my Easter eggs. Easter eggs were quite popular this year, I noticed, obviously, because it's close to Easter but uh, I did get quite a few this is Flutter by Heidi's I know this I can remember her giving it to me and she's in our team but I love it because she's Flutter by and she's been using all these gorgeous butterflies and she's very very clever Heidi is at wrapping and using a box she's very origami type sort of thing and I don't know whether you noticed as I'm opening it this just wraps and wraps and wraps and she's got Tic Tacs too. <laughs> but how clever is that? There is no glue. It is just a strip of paper and it's fold, fold, fold. And that's flutterbyheidi.co.uk. And she is great at those sort of boxes. That's definitely a Heidi special. So I've got some more card fronts. Big Happy Birthday by Sarah Rayner. Oh, this is using the um, 3D embossing folder on the background. Love it by uh, Lindsay Liz Tanner's Yard. And there's a woofer on this one as well, so it's going to be a favourite by Lavinia. Oh yes, I am. Um, we met Lavinia. We went. We saw her in one of the restaurants, and we sat with her for a bit. She's lovely. Um, this was this was Liz Yule. She's my uh, my uplines uplines team. So she's like a sister team, really, which is quite nice. I like Liz. She's lovely. She's old stable crafts as well. She makes some gorgeous things. Um, what else have I got in my little box of tricks? Got some more three D bits and pieces. Let's just churn those out, and I'll go through those. So, has someone stapled their box? Kumu Crafts. That means I'm going to have to rip it. Well, I'm going in. Come on. I'm going to have to go again. <laughs> They've done a very good job of sealing that. And inside. Vegetable soap. Oh, and their business card, that's nice. Pretty box. A notepad. It's a beautiful day notepad by Lucy Tustian. Not very good with names if I say them wrong, but I am sorry. 
Now this is lovely, this is Danielle Hiram, but she's actually cased a member of our team. She's cased Jez, who is someone I do the project share with on a Thursday. And Jez has got some gorgeous projects and that's got a little sweeties and in, uh, smarties inside. Um, but yeah, and she's credited Jez, which is lovely. And this one is by Nicola Carson. She's from Belfast by the look of it. And in hers, Oh, little bunny 20 pound notes. It's cute, isn't it? That's going to be a chocolate sweet. And another one, five pounds. That's 15 pounds worth of bunny sweets. <laughs> isn't that cute for Easter? I like that. That's cute. Hope your day is as wonderful as you. Another envelope. This is by Jambi. And Jambi. I love the flowers on the front. Aren't they gorgeous? She's got us glasses wipes, and that's so handy because I wear glasses. Genius! Might not be as handy for everyone who doesn't, but I wear glasses, and I'm only thinking of me. I like that. A little coaster by Sarah Crafts. Let's pop this one open. Dum -dum 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 -dum. Lots of people have used Lemon and Lime Twist. I reckon they're as upset about it retiring as me. I have stocked up. I have about 20 packs of it. Oh, this is my Sally. Oh, yeah, this is my Sally. This is Sally Stampers. Oh, Sally, that's gorgeous. And Lemon and Lime Twist, because she knows I love it. So Sally is my roomie at these events. Um, I didn't think I swapped with her on Saturday. I thought I swapped with her on Sunday. And she's lovely. She's so clever. She did a make and take on Sunday at the Poodles team event, which was just genius. She's she's a very talented person. Sally Stampers, if you want to go and check out Sally. And then a box which was a little bit worse for wear through travel. I, I bent it. But in my defence, I had to try and get everything back in a suitcase. So that's quite nice, isn't it? It's tied. Oh, well, they're not again. <laughs> These people never want you to get into anything. And I think this is just the design of the box. Oh, look, it's a matchbox box. I'm just trying to see if it says on it who it's by. It doesn't, but thank you. It's cute. Envelope. Seem to have had a few of them. Oh, they're stuck on every flap. I'm going to have to rip him. Oh, isn't that clever? Tea bag in it, but it matches the colour of the paper. I like the attention to detail with that one. And then finally, three more left by the look of it. I got this card. That's a special card. Look at this. So it sits like that. So it actually looks like the card is flying as well as the butterfly. Isn't that clever? It's by Jill Moore. I love it. I might have a go at casing that, Jill, if you don't mind. That's really nice. I'm put that on the side. And then I've got a desk calendar from Audrey. I'm made by Audrey. And finally, the other week I cased a chap called Martin, Martin Mayhem, which is Martin Stone. And I swapped with Martin. And how gorgeous is this card? Isn't that beautiful? We can feel another case coming on, Martin. It's beautiful. Really nice. And then my upline, Sam, she got us a little something. And she got me the Blossoms elements from the catalogue, which is great. Um, and in turn, I got my downline of presents. So um, I got mine crafting aprons. <laughs> we all like to treat each other. So I'm just going to pop those back in the box so I know which event that was from. Fancy Sally sneaking in a swap on both days, and I only gave her one. I feel Ted guilty now. Um, and then I will get on to the swaps from our team day because there were some gorgeous ones there as well. There we go. That's the box pretty much back full again, I think. Now our team day is in a bag, so I might just chuck all of those out on the desk and go through them from there. You don't mind me being messy, do you? 
So, first up was this one. This is a special gift from Heather at Stampin' Nelly. She does our project share on a Thursday. And she gave this just to the project share group. And they're... Oh, they're Max Welts. Oh, I love those. Thank you. I always have my wax melter on while I'm crafting. That's a great, great swap. Thank you. She's lovely, isn't she? So I do all my project shares with her on Thursday if you want any links to get to Heather's website. And then this is my bag of goodies. <laughs> oh, I told you, I got a lot from my Poodlers team. I'm just going to run through them all um, with you now. I think I've left something in the bag. I have, they were my swaps, that's okay. So first of all, I've got this little box. This is from Janice. Jazz, uh, jazzle craft, jazzle dazzle crafts, jazzle crafts. There'll be a card in here from Janice. I just know she's jazzly. <laughs> she's lovely. I like Janice, she's one of our Scottish demos. Oh, she got me a bunny inside the bunny box. See, I love it when people do this sort of thing. So, Janice, they are jazzle dazzle crafts. I was close, wasn't I? I knew it was jazzly. <laughs> And I chose Peter because he had a pink, pink jumper on him. And um, you don't often see them coloured pink. You normally see them blue. So I thought that was just genius. I quite liked it. Making her a girl. Uh, where am I going next? This is Valerie Broomfield. Oh, she's lovely. I tell you what, all of our poodles are lovely. I'm going to stop saying they're lovely because they all are nice. Um, and she's got some glittery pencils. Now, um, the nail file come with a business card, so I will go to that one in a minute so I can tell you who made that one. Um, those were my swaps that I did. They're on my YouTube video. I did those yesterday. Um, oh, yeah, this is a card. This is from Bex. She's lovely. She's a new member of our team. Really nice, and I love that. Well, I say she's a new member of our team. It was her first... Um, retreat she could have been a member for ages and just not come to a retreat but it was her first one she was really nice this is from my sally again from sally stampers and she's got some wounds in there i'll do a quick open only so i can get the uh the sweets because they're my favorites she also had a big tub of those on the table i got through loads isn't that good see Sally, she's spoiled us. Isn't that lovely? She's bound to have that over on her website at Sally Stampers. Um, Violet Gibson. She got us a note card, which is great because I have so many ideas after the weekend that I could do with a note card to write them all down in. The bunny. Let's have a look. I do find that this set got used quite a bit I suppose because it's Eastery so <laughs> and Jemima's. oh it's Karen Karen Kilner I didn't see much of Karen this weekend normally I see her quite a bit but we were, we were at different hotels and we need to see each other but that's Karen's oh this is Jez this is Nigeza Creates um, also from our Thursday blog share um, that one's a special one. I'll do that one at the end. This one was Tracy Walkden. Good call, Tracy. Biscuits like that. Um. <laughs> Curious Moose Crafts. Samantha Thorpe. Oh, what a cool name, Samantha. I like that. Curious Moose Crafts. I like your business card as well. It's gorgeous. Um... Tea bag. Oh, what a good idea. Look, she's attached the butterfly to the tea. That's, that's clever. That's outside the box thinking, that is. Um, Christine. Christine Bettany. Oh, chocolate heart. That's cute. She's the envelope punch board for that one. I like the envelope punch board. Um, happy spring. There is a after eight mint in there. And that's by Andy Crafts. Uh, 
Oh, some more pencils in another one. Pootless Rock, we do. We're a good little team. That's from Lisa from Little Owls Crafts. And then Lizzie's Crafty Arts, that's Karen Little. Some sweets in an envelope. Cute. And I've got a sweet from somewhere else. Some things fell out. I don't know. We'll see what's empty and that's where that's from. It's a nice box. It's a sturdy box. That is very sturdy. That wasn't going to get knocked around on the journey. Oh, dairy milk. <laughs> that's from Karen Taylor. Karen sat with us all weekend. She's lovely. It was really nice to get to know her because I didn't know her before the weekend and she was a really nice lady. Ah, this is um, Yvonne, and it was Yvonne who did the nail file holder. Which is handy for me, because look what happened. I know. Go to on stage, come back with half a nail. Terrible. Pillow box. Oh, it hasn't got who it is. It's got a fruit salad. That's mine. <laughs> oh, they're always handy for mark. That can mark the page in my notebook that Violet got me. What a clever idea little peg okay this one Elizabeth Finney <laughs> Easter eggs this is why I live on stage I just eat and eat and eat afterwards I'm a real glutton so this one is Julie Addison from Luna Crafts and she's got oh, I didn't need to cut it open because I could have opened it at the top I'm dense sometimes Freddo's. <laughs> my gosh, next time these guys see me, I'll be rolling with all of this chocolate. Oh, this was lovely. This was Karen Varley, and she gave everyone a personalised pencil holder. So I got mine with Helen Slim on. Um, that was quite cute. Butterfly. Colourful butterfly too. Oh, that's a big butterfly and a little butterfly on top. That's quite cute. Oh, another heart chocolate, and that's from Kayla Love at Kayla's Crafty Creations. Sweet. Oh, I know what this is from. This is from the. This is from there, but I don't know who did it. I can't remember, but I loved it. Isn't that simple? But isn't it effective? That is. It is cute. I like that. <laughs> this was from Catherine Drinkwater, um, and she's from Amanda Charlesworth's team. And she joined us for the day. Oh, I ruined your handbag, Catherine. And she said that she cased this from Amanda um, when she gave it me. So give credit where it's due. Amanda and Catherine. It's, they're gorgeous anyway. And it's got lovely little ladybird in. Isn't that sweet? Love it. Then, oh, Jill from Paper Daisy Crafting, the one that I also feature on a Thursday. She got a big Easter egg for me. <laughs> this one, this one was Louise Dyer. She got me a candle. It smells quite nice too. Honestly, scents and chocolate I'm always okay for after on stage. <laughs> and I ate loads of chocolate from making my own swap, so I'm being very naughty really. Oh, that's Oh, it's got squished. It's cute, but it's got squished. People get them to places fine, and then I just ruin them on the way home and squish them. We got what we got. Oh, a lip sole. That's different, thank you. Whoever you are, it's down the bottom. I can't get it out. My fingers are too fat. Heather, oh, it's Heather from Stampin' Nelly. So she also got me the wax melts and a lip, so I'm feeling very special, Heather. Uh, Inky Butterfly, that's Verity. She's also on the Project Share group on Thursday. And Verity's gone and stuck hers, so I have to rip it open to show you, but I don't want to because it's beautiful. Verity, I'm upset at having to cut it. Oh, ho, 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 ho. what a good thing to be in. Isn't that gorgeous? I do really like it. 
and it looked beautiful. Mm. I'll stick it back together. <laughs> I'll stick it back. Then this one, triangle box. That's really neat how it's in at the end, isn't it? I like that. chunky pen from Yvonne Felton. I've seen Yvonne somewhere else. So Yvonne did the pens and she did the nail files. Unless I've got my business cards mixed up. But yeah, she did both. Thank you, Yvonne. And I like my pen. That's going over here in my pen holder. Um, a few more that's come off the table. Wishes. That's from Paper J Crafts got oh my wish list for uh, the new catalogue I'm gonna need a sheet longer than that there's some gorgeous stuff in it if you want it just let me know and I'll put you on the list I'm not sure who that is I think it was Elizabeth, Elizabeth Thompson but I can't remember so if it was someone else other than Elizabeth I'm sorry um oh that's cute a little treat for someone sweet again by Karen McDonald Another one of our Scottish demos. She's, she's lovely too. Thank you, Karen. Oh, I haven't even looked what you've given me, Karen. Oh, chocolate coins. <laughs> You're one of a kind. Oh, I love this. This was a swap to purse. So let me open it because it will say who it was on the other side. And I was like, oh, it's an octopus. And I can't remember who it was gave it me. She says, no, it's a swap to purse. <laughs> what a clever idea. So it was, oh, it was Karen Howell. I got into a mess with Karen. She's Welsh and I'm terrible with accents. So I guessed Scottish and got into trouble. <laughs> oh, with a fresh and white. And that sits in a business card. That is clever, that is. I like that. Thank you. She forgave me for, for getting the accents wrong. <laughs> Not many would, I don't think. But yeah, my accent knowledge is terrible. That's Flutter by Heidi again. And she's, yeah. Oh, that's clever. When you open that, this bit pops up, so the actual tea bag comes up with it. She's pretty clever, is Heidi. She's got away with paper. This is cute. Isn't that cute? And he's got a little tail. And he's holding hands. Just sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Oh, look. I'm talking of sweet, sweet, sweets. Of sweet, sweet, sweets. Gosh, someone's had fun folding this up. Linda Worth. Thank you, Linda. That is really clever though, isn't it? I think, I think it's just cute. It's cute. I've made a mistake here. That, that candle's Louise Dwyer. So who was this candle? Oh, someone was watching it, I bet, when I unwrapped that. And I'm like, no, Helen, that's mine. Who's that one? Oh, that's Kaz. Kaz Shears. Sorry, Kaz. <laughs> I just knew there was a candle in the box from Louise and guessed. So that one's Louise Tyres and this one's Kaz's. And they both did candles. And that's... Oh. And both smell nice. Both very talented. What a mistake. <laughs> now, this one... I like it because it's... You see it? It's not just your standard cracker. Clever cracker. And I think it was by Sheila. Pretty sure it was by Sheila. Come on. Don't make me cut you. This is the white ribbon. And she's curled it. I'm gonna have to cut it, otherwise I'm gonna be here all day trying to undo that because it's just fraying on me. Blackcurrant and rum. Blackcurrant and rum preserve. I'm only reading rum. It's rum. <laughs> yeah, and it is. It's by Sheila. That's not going to pick up. But yeah. It's a cute cracker, wasn't it? And then 
this is a very special swap because this is from my team member, Karen Tilly from Tilly Crafts. And she's been amazing. She made one of these for my mom, so I bought it back last night. So I had a spy. And she's done so much work. I mean, check it out. It's Lemon Lime Twist, which we all know is my favourite anyway. But then when you open it... Yeah, that's pretty clever, right? Look at that. You've got more parcels. And there's all of Karen's details. So you can head over to Karen's blog and you can see what Karen has made. Tillycrafts.co.uk and the details will be on her blog next week. So that's this week, so watch out for it. And she has given me sugar, a biscuit, and tea. Everything I need for staying away in a hotel at on stage. Hello, dear friends, sending lots of love your way. Hasn't she been talented? I love that. Thank you, Karen. And you were a pleasure to be around all weekend. I've had so much fun. And then finally, my lovely upline. Sam, she gifted us all this tin and inside it was some vouchers for us to spend. A little treat, a little lollipop in, a pen and then she gifted us a notebook but the notebook didn't fit in the tin. <laughs> she didn't take the measurements before she bought the notebook. <laughs> We've all done it. Um, but I thought it was such a cute way of gifting the tin. And I love this. These are available from the current catalogue, but I don't think they carried over. So if you want them, aren't they gorgeous? And she also got me, because I presented, um, she got me a little gift in a in a gorgeous bag, actually. I'll see if I can get it in. It's in this gift bag, all rainbow coloured, because if you know Sam from Poodle, she's a rainbow gal. Um, and she got me a Yankee candle, which is beautiful. And it smells really nice. I've already smelt it, Sam. And um, an ideas book for my master planning. <laughs> but yeah, it was a great fun time and I've had some lovely things. So thank you to everyone who swapped with me. And if you're sitting here and thinking that would be a fun experience, I'd like to go to one of those and be involved in the retreats and the swapping and meeting everybody. Message me and I will tell you exactly how you can come, and be, come involved and become a demonstrator. Thank you for joining me and I will see you soon. Bye everyone.